welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you um, one of the many looks you can do with this palette. This is the Complete Face Palette by Another Stories in Festoon Classics. We've got a deep red color, an ivory uh, shimmery color, a really dark greenish black color and then a green um, shimmery color. These are all cream so you can do whatever you want with it actually. So I'm going to show you the look that I created. I already put uh, my foundation on, my brows and a little bit of contour, but the rest of my face I'm going to do with this palette. I'm only going to work with synthetic brushes today because it goes better with cream products. So first I take this pretty dense synthetic brush and I'm going into this dark green. So I'm just going to pick up some product not a lot and I'm gonna put it in the outer V and I'm just gonna dab it it's gonna dab it on and work it in gotta make sure that at the end the product is higher than in the middle so you're going a bit down towards the middle of your eye so this is just the base that we're setting then we're going to do the other side as well. And then I'm going to take another brush. It's kind of the same. It's also a synthetic dense brush. I just pick another one because I have to go in a light color. And I'm going to go into the green sparkly cream color. And I'm going to swirl this around because this one is a bit drier than the dark one. I'm going to put this in the middle of my eye. I really like shimmer on my eyes because it enlarges my eyes because I have pretty small eyes. And I'm going to go over the edge a little bit into the dark color. Then I'm going to take the other brush again and go back into the dark. And I'm gonna go over the line that it's kind of more blended and deepen it up. Then I'm gonna take um, a clean fluffy brush <laughs> and I'm gonna blend the edges a little bit. I know it's a cream product so it's it's more difficult to blend with a fluffy brush but it's just the little edges so that you know, it will work for that. Alright. Then, I'm going to take um, a winged eyeliner brush. This one's by Zoeva and I really love it. And I'm gonna go into the dark color and I'm gonna line my upper eye. I'm just gonna do a thin line. I don't want it to be too big. Just a little wing eye. This is the hard part. Matching your other side. You know, this just takes practice. Wing, wing, uh, eyeliner, because it's so precise. I mean, in the beginning, I sucked. I really did. But you just need to practice. Practice makes good. And then I'm going to take this brush again and we are going to darken it up just a little more. Because I like it to be um, a nighttime look. You also have um, another version of, the, of this palette which is more summery. Well, it's still, this is really the autumn or even winter version of the palette. The other one has a sparkly gold, it has a, a dark navy blue. Um, yeah, it's also really pretty, but this is more, more for autumn. So we're going to blend it again. 
just a little bit. I'm going to take the eyeliner brush again and I'm going into the red. And I'm just going to put a little line under my eye. And then I'm just gonna blend it a little bit with my finger. Just smudge it a little bit. I'm going to add a little bit more of the highlight. I'm going to take uh, a third dense brush and I'm going into the lightest color. And I'm gonna put this right in the middle, only in the middle, just to lighten it up some more. I mean this you can obviously, you can do this with your finger as well. Everything that's cream is nice to do with your finger. It's even easier with your finger. So, like that. And then, I'm just going to apply mascara. Then for blush, we are going to take a synthetic blush brush and I'm going into the red color. I'm just going to dab it in here a little bit. I'm going to apply this to my cheekbones and the apples of my cheeks. And just make sure you blend it well. <clears throat> then I'm going back with my light brush and I'm going into the light and I'm going to use this as a highlight. I'm going to put a little bit on my nose, I'm going to put some above my cupid's bow. The point of my nose. And then I'm going in with my finger and I'm going to put it on the cheekbones. Just going to dab it on. And then for the lips, of course, we're going to go for the red color. So I'm just taking a lip brush. You can actually also, you can make it darker by um, mixing these two. You can make it lighter with the, the highlight color. I'm telling you, you can do a lot with this palette. So yeah, this is the final look. I hope you like it and I hope that I gave you some ideas uh, on how to work with this palette. See you next time!